That's Jacob. That's Mickey. Coming at you from the Poe House. House. You should say that sometimes. Anyway, so the next movie that we watched, I know we're still wearing the same clothes from last time because guess what? We didn't record before. But anyway, the last movie we watched was Ace Ventura. But not, see, this is a double thing, so it's got. Both. Yeah, and it's even got like the animated series in it. Is this the first this one? That's the first one. Okay. So Ace Ventura, Pet Detective. Do, 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 do. Who has not seen this movie, honestly? Like really? So, this is rated PG-13. It's directed by Tom Shadiak. I have no idea how to say that man's name. Produced by James G. Robinson. It stars Jim Carrey. Who else? Mm -hmm. Sean Young, Courtney Cox, Tone Loke, who has a very cool voice, by the way, and Dan Marino. Came out in 1994. Jacob, what did you like about this movie? What's with the radio voice? <laughs> I'm playing. <laughs> Well, the movie was hilarious. I mean, like, honestly, who hasn't seen this movie? It's honestly, freaking funny honestly, as heck. Who should? Um, and yeah, Jim Carrey, this was definitely like his prime. This was like his absolute best mm -hmm. when he was at his best. Yeah. Um, just everything that he does, even just the way he moves, is just so funny. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, I was working at a daycare whenever this movie came out, and so many, and I worked with the school age kids, so many of them would come in and they would do his movements and everything, and it's just hysterical. Yeah. And so, besides, obviously, it's funny. We get that. Um, but the, the plot itself actually was kind of a plausible plot. It wasn't, you know, ridiculous, even though Jim Ace is quite over the top and very absurd in everything that he does and says. <laughs> um, the the plot itself if it didn't have like a comedic take to it actually could have been a very serious like crime thriller probably it's actually listed in imdb under thriller really <laughs> yes uh, there you funny. go yeah well yes i agree it, it was totally ridiculous and so stupid funny and you know it, and it made fun of other movie tropes such as the spy genre and mm. you know and, and the things that spies do to get from point a to point b whatever but it was just hysterical stuff and just referring to people for how they look you know like captain Stubing, you know the younger people won't know who that is but oh my gosh it's just side splitting awesome what did you not like about it nothing really like no i didn't have anything put down yeah, What's to not like? like? I mean, who doesn't like to laugh, honestly? Really? But my only thing was that there was just a couple of scenes, this is just minor stuff, that really didn't make sense. Like, there's a scene where these cops should have seen something because they were behind the actors in question, and mm -hmm. there was no reaction from them, like, oh my gosh, you know, so just silly stuff like that. But, I mean, honestly, it's fun. It's a super fun movie. Yeah. What about the characters and the actors? Again, Jim Carrey, what do you expect? What do you want? I mean, it's Jim Carrey. Um, this is very much his movie, like um, how I said before. This this is like Jim's movie in the same way that like Austin Powers is Mike Myers' movie. It's just, it's their movies, They're, you know? Um, but he's absolutely hilarious. Everyone else is really good, too. Um, I know Sean Young, she does tend to play like these weird characters. Mm -hmm. Because, like, in Blade Runner, she's a replicant, mm -hmm. so... And then there's another movie she did called Dr. Jekyll and Miss Hyde, where she plays, you know, the female version of Dr. Jekyll. See, I've not seen that. Um, but, I mean, I she... I think that was her... Anyway. <laughs> she was good. Courtney Cox is great. Um, this was right around when Friends first started, I think. Mm -hmm. um, so she was just starting to become a thing, too. Um, everybody was great. Mm-hmm. And everyone had really good comedic timing as well. Yeah, it was fun to watch, yeah. Um, of course, Ace was hilarious. Like, his antics and his, uh, the way he responds to people. Yes, Satan? Oh, I'm sorry. I thought you were someone else. <laughs> you know? Don't you want to speak to people like that sometimes? Sometimes, yes. I totally want to be that way sometimes. Just be completely life. stupid. Oh, my gosh. I don't know if people would laugh, though. They might hit me. But um, I also liked Ray Finkel's mom. She was just... Yeah. She was super sweet. I loved her. <laughs> he should die of gonorrhea and burn in hell. <laughs> and all while smiling. Want a cookie? <laughs> uh -huh. Like, excuse me? Who are you? That's awesome. Okay, overall thoughts. 
I mean, I think I kind of said it. It's great. Um, it's hilarious. It's great. Watch it <laughs> if you have. If you for some reason have not seen this movie, watch it. Find it. Watch it. Yeah. There were so many laugh out loud moments and so many quotable lines. Mm -hmm. um, oh, righty then. And like I said, I was working at the daycare when it came out, and the kids were not only mimicking his movements, but they were also quoting so many lines, and they did it so well, so much better than I could ever do, but yeah, so totally, I laugh every time I watch it, and we've watched it several times, mm -hmm. and I laugh out loud every single time, it's just a funny movie, totally funny movie, rolling on the floor, laughing out my butt out loud, rating, yes, I don't want to swear, sorry, okay, <laughs> <laughs> so that's what we thought of Ventura Pet Detective. Mm -hmm. So, guess what we're watching next? Ah, could it be Ace Ventura 2 when nature calls? Now we're going to skip over to something else. All right, yeah, totally forget it. Okay, so that's our discussion on Ace Ventura Pet Detective. Uh, let us know in the comments if you agree with us or if you disagree, but be respectful. Let's mm -hmm. not hurt anybody's feelings or call anybody names. We're all grown ups here, I think. I hope. We can have a childlike heart without the negativity. Okay. Why did I just do that? I have just mimicked my 18-year-old daughter. Yep, that's exactly what I just did. Oh, That my. won't happen again. <laughs> Honestly, I didn't even see it. Well, you will in the playback. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so, yes. Um, <laughs> like, comment, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell. <laughs> and anything else? <laughs> Let us know what we should be doing. <laughs> and how I can punish him. <laughs> He's taller than me. <laughs> he might be able to kick my butt. Okay. Bye. Bye. From the Poe House. Toodles. <laughs>